So let me let y'all know something, bruh. Y'all see the tweet. Y'all see the thumbnail. KD has figured something out that other players need to figure out when it comes to Skip Bayless. It's called fake love. Kevin Durant knows. He knows that you don't like me. You just want to spite LeBron, and that's called fake love. That's why KD responded like that. And a lot of people are, some people do understand it, but a lot of people don't. Maybe they too young, or they never just experienced it before. But keep growing. Keep getting older and older. By the time you're in your 20s, before you hit 30, you're going to know what fake love is. Before you hit 30, you're going to know what fake love is. Y'all always tell me, I be, you know, y'all agree what I'm saying. I be giving good advice or whatever. Listen to this. If somebody can't give you praise or props without dissing somebody else, it ain't about you. They just don't like that person. Take me for instance. Whoever, whatever your name is, listen to this. Let's say it's, let's say it's you and me, right? And you got a homie that's like, damn, man. Man, your rents is so much better than Genghis Khan, man. So you make a channel. Man, I know your channel going to blow up. You go past Genghis Khan, man. They in my, they under my comments. Man, don't nobody listen to this channel no more, man. His subscribers barely moving. Y'all need to go to this channel. Then then he going to give me like, man, your PS5 rents is the best now. That nigga Genghis Khan played out. Newsflash. That's fake love. He don't like you. He don't appreciate you. He just hate me. He just hate me. Trust me. Take hate. Just pure hate over fake love. Take hate over fake love, bro. For real, for real. And KD is just realizing what other players need to realize. Other people need to realize that. Other people need to realize, look, if this dude give me congratulations, he don't care about that. Kawhi Leonard needs to real. he don't care about me. He just hate LeBron. And I'm not even speaking to that situation. I'm just speaking to more people in the comments that will say, oh, he's congratulating you and you're dissing him. Y'all got to learn the difference, man. Before y'all grow up and before y'all go through life and experience these things, y'all got to know the difference, bruh. That's why when a lot of y'all get these, Wendy's hell out here. That's why when a lot of y'all get these channels, a lot of y'all blow up and then y'all make a video and say, oh, this person did this to me, this person did, because y'all don't understand fake love, even though the signs be all in y'all face. It be all in y'all fucking face. So KD taught us a valuable, valuable lesson for the people, for the younger people, for the older people who sad to say haven't learned this lesson yet. Do not accept fake love. I know it's going to make you feel good temporarily. I know it's going to fuel your fire a little bit. But if it's fake love, don't accept that shit. And KD, let it be known. Get the basically get the fuck away from me. Stop talking about me. The only reason you elevated me is because you feel like it 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 devalues somebody else. The person who you really got an agenda with. The person who you really care about. Cause caring don't automatically mean love or like them. You can hate somebody and you can care about them so much that you're obsessing over them. That's what that is. So I just wanted to talk about that. Of course, you know, they're not going to respond. Skip not going to respond to it. Of course, because his agenda is to hate on LeBron with for anything, win or lose. And even Kevin Durant knows that. Even he knows that. Other players might be figuring it out too. But just to the fans that saying, oh, he's he not congratulating you. And please, when you go out into the world and when you grow up and when you do shit like this, don't fall for that, dude. That's the type of shit that will get your career ended, your life ended. That fake love shit is way more dangerous than hate. Way more dangerous than hate. Once again, I'm going to leave you with this. If you cannot congratulate somebody, if you cannot congratulate somebody without downing somebody else, you need to know if you don't, if, if if a person can't congratulate you, congratulate you without downing somebody else, and every time they congratulate you, they downing the other nigga or they taking a shot at the other dude. That's fake love. They don't care about you. They just hate the other dude, and they feel like you may be the biggest threat to the person that they hate. They don't give a fuck about you. 
They don't love you. They not invest. They don't want to see you succeed. If you go in a different lane than him, all them compliments is going to stop. All that love is going to stop because you ain't no threat to the person that he obsessed with. Be looking out for that, man. Be looking out for that. Do not fall into that. Now I'll let y'all later.